You still don't believe it, do you? I can't. You think I'm being stupid? I think. You care for your dad so much you can't conceive of a world where you let him get hurt. Come here. I need to show you something. Laufe? My mother's? I wish it weren't empty, but... I know how it feels... to lose a parent... to lose both. Your mother may be gone, but your father... You've still got time to say goodbye. I know what you're trying to say. And I appreciate it. I do. But... I don't know. We've got to be more than a bunch of stories with our endings already written. happens to you now. I don't know. Like I said, once you're gone, my part in this is over. So, you know, feel free to stay. I think your part is as big as you want it to be. What are you gonna do? No idea. But I can't just sit back and let my dad die. I gotta get back. Okay. Huh. The stars here are different. No. You just are. I am gonna see you again. Sure. Okay, now. Close your eyes. And hold that tight. You don't want to lose it. Home. Think of it. Repeat it. Other home, other home, other home.
I gotta get back to Sindri's and figure out how to save Father. And I gotta keep Ironwood and Ingravota a secret somehow. What'd I get myself into? I... I wanted to visit Fenrir. For two days. I... Do not lie to me again! Why did you come here? Alone? Do you seek death? No more than you. Then why? Why? What is it you will not tell me? I have tried to walk this path with you. We follow your every whim. But you don't believe in any of it. And still, I follow! <laughs> Because all that matters is that you are safe. But that's not all that matters. Who's keeping you safe? I do not need you to protect me. You sure about that? What do you know? I can't talk about it. But I just need you to trust me. You kept secrets, but I trust you. That's not the same. Why not? You hid things. Mother hid things. You had good reasons, and so do I. Why can't you just...
How do you know? Corporeal, but different. Looks like the blaster's finally done it. We don't want to fight! Stop! Remember us? Not sure this is a balcony we met, lad. How do you know? Corporeal, but different. Looks like the bastard's finally done it. We don't want to fight! Violation imaginable. No! You do not want this. Call your mind. Control it. She was our friend. Maybe. For the moment. You're of more use to me. Alive. <clears throat> Sorry. 
Earth. Home. Home? Really? You will tell the truth when I return. Now I must set things right. Um, we'll take him. Oh, Your Majesty. A pleasure to see you again. Bronyifer. Do not let him out of your sight. You heard him, sunshine. Come on, get a move on. What is it you want? I refuse to remain bound to this realm. We travel to Vanaheim. Well, guess it's just us then. <sighs> One gateway to Vanaheim coming right up. If you are still bound, how will you travel? I crafted a protection ward that'll keep me from being pulled out of the realm. It should hold until I find what I need. And what is that? The source of the magic that binds me to Midgard. We're going to find it. And destroy it. I will help you. But it will not change what I have done. I know. That's why I still might kill you when this is over. We going or what? Ain't going nowhere without this. Sure. Where would you muck spouts even be without me? And what is it you expect to need Kratos for, Highness? Clearly, you've been quite capable of breaking Odin's curses on your own. The other curses grew weak from Thimble Winter, but I still needed help to break them. This one is held strong. So all that trying to kill him, that's just your goddessy way of asking for help? I don't recall asking you to come along. It's because you didn't. I got an old drinking buddy I've been meaning to look up once this joint were back on the map. Got a hunch lending you mokes a hand's gonna end me up where I'm going. And what makes you think that? Cause last I heard tell, she was running with that beef wit brother of yours. Freyr... ...is not a part of this. Well, my hunch says otherwise. Scroat, too. I can feel the pool of the Binding Curse. Its source is further in. Follow me. Buggier than a moonful hind shit pit out here. And nearly as fragrant. Suppose Thimble Winter's to blame. But if it helps these two find peace... This is a temporary alliance, Mimir. Anything beyond that would require trust. Oh, please. You know damn well Kratos isn't the true cause of your suffering. You're both as much a part of my suffering as anyone. Come on, let's find a way forward. A nose. You'll have to try harder than that, Brock. Just you wait, smart guy. Something's wrong. My spell, I can feel it slipping. Well, that's Fimble Winter for you. You don't understand. I'll be torn from the realm. What can be done? Something I was hoping to avoid. 
Seems I don't have much choice. Come on, then. You had a way around Odin's curse this whole time. No. I discovered it once you unlocked realm travel, and it solves very little. This form is extremely limiting. That's Thimblewinter for you. Not. Watch where you're going. I told you, prune it from a safe distance if you'd rather not get poisoned. Has everyone gone, I wonder? They must have withdrawn, hidden themselves out in the wilds, and covered their tracks with magic. No way of knowing how many are left or how to reach them. Aesir ran cockshot all over this place, huh? You can thank Mimir for that. War with the Vanir was never my idea. My idea was brokering the marriage to end it. A great success that was. Obviously, the peace was no less a disaster than the marriage. Did he invade again, as soon as I was exiled? <laughs> I recognize this market. Villages would meet and trade here. Why'd they never rebuild?
market, huh? Looks like they sure left behind a lot of goodies. Shame to let them collect dust. That's one way of looking at it. Pretty sure there's loot you're missing, if and you want to hunt around some more. <laughs> Chew on this, you gaggle-eyed beast! Hey, Bunk-Tear! Come on! Big Boomer coming up! Remember your brother stirring up an awful scene. Why do you keep bringing him up? My brother is no concern of yours. Do you understand? Oh, I understand plenty. Hey! The plant life grows more dangerous the further we go. Hope you're up for it. Listen. I know how bad it can get with that. Sindri and I were on the out so long it was like not having a brother at all. Now nah, I take some of the fall for that on account of me walking out. But it never stopped me blaming him most. Any of this sound familiar so far? And what is your point? My point is that weren't the end all of things after all. Once we got our heads right, it was like no time. He went straight back to being as big a pain in my ass as he ever was. That's family. You gotta keep them close, or they make you good and crazy. Why do you think I need to hear any of this right now? My focus is on regaining my freedom, and I have no intention of being distracted. Look, all I'm saying is, if you happen to find yourself talking to your brother, Maybe the worst words said between you don't have to be the last one said. Enough! When the day comes to face Freya again, it will be when I am standing on my feet and free. You understand me? It will not be while I'm stuck in this preposterous situation. Got a case of pride, I get it. Hope yours clears up quicker than mine did. A touching story, that was. What did Odin do to drive everyone away? 
What weapons did he make the dwarves build him? How much was just Mjolnir? Can one man do this much damage? Depends on the weapon. And the man. What is this? Not now, brother. We've got company. do anything with that yet, it seems. Hold up! If you want to keep your insides inside. Yeah! All yours, big guy. Your people not receiving visitors? I wouldn't know. They're not my people anymore. Give me a boost. <clears throat> you don't go telling no one about that. Come on up. Bet you're glad old Brock's around to save you. Uh-oh. Yeah! We should probably go get him. Keep your guard up. What 
do we have here? Oh, one eye, send another god to do his dirty work. Thor, too busy. We do not serve Odin. <laughs> no? Picked a dangerous place for sightseeing, then. All right. Now, now. No need for threats, brother. Oh, I know that voice. <laughs> you know, I'd cut off your head, but it seems somebody beat me to it. Aye. Oh, quite observant, brother. <laughs> no, you're no brother of mine. He sold my sister to that. Quick. We broke it a piece. Oh. Did you now? Where is it? Hmm? And where is my sister? Some dungeon in Asgard? Is she even alive? Answer me. I guess we'll settle for blood. Stop! What is that? Why do you speak in her voice? It's me, Ingvi. There's no time to explain, just listen. These men are in my service. I'm here to reclaim what's been taken from me. It's too late. You can't undo what's been done. I can. I will. Now let them pass. So, you serve my sister. Oh. Oh. Don't we all? Put him down. What's with leaving me hanging like that? Trusty hag. Oh, can it, Blubber? Come here. Well, found who I was looking for. Think I'm gonna stay and catch up. Oh, are you now? Do as you wish. Brother, if you wouldn't mind, I'd have a word with Lord Freya. Reminds me of a Vanaheim song I heard long ago. Ain't you gonna introduce me to this tall glass of milk you got for a bodyguard? Of course I was gonna. That's Kratos. Oh, you can call him whatever pops into your head. Kratos, loser. We go back. Well, I guess that's better than nothing. What are you looking for? Ready when you are.
You make up your mind. Come back if you need more crap. We wish this camp kept secret. Understood? I will not compromise it. No, we wouldn't dare. Good. Sorry we got off on the wrong foot there, stranger. We're pretty used to only seeing Ace here in these parts. Don't typically get friendly faces. That... That is a friendly face, right? His name is Kratos, and no. The Ace here on Vanaheim. <laughs> yeah, we've been occupied since... Yeah, I lost count. What is your plan? Still kind of working on it. Mm -hmm. Brother, I think I could be of use here. If my counsel is welcome. Well, I'll take what I can get. Your mission will go considerably smoother without me in the mix. Come back for me when you're done. Hey, Kratos. As long as you're working for my sister, carefully you don't screw up. She's not too big on forgiveness. A bit late for that one, I'm afraid. All right, let's see what we've got here. Tell me about your army. Oh, you're looking at it. What, you five? Against Odin's army? Well, six, if you count the dog. Oh, fuck me. Yep. Do you know their numbers? Oh, numbers, movements, outposts. Uh, we have good intel. Let's have a look at the map then. What? You just came to stare? 